Hi there! Welcome to MCSI. My name is Anna. In this video, I will demonstrate how you can perform reverse image searching. If you are wondering how images benefit in OSINT investigation, I invite you to watch another video on our channel. You will find the link to it in the description box below. Let's start with understanding what reverse image searching is. During an OSINT investigation, you may come across an image that you think is relevant to the target. If you want to identify all the web pages containing this image, then you can perform a reverse image search. Provide the image as the input to a search engine and retrieve the list of web pages containing the image. In some cases, the version of the image you currently have may be edited or modified in some way. To find other versions of the image, a reverse image search can be performed. If you require different resolutions of your target image, you can perform a search for the same. Most search engines have a feature to perform reverse image searches. There are also specialized tools that help you perform this task. Every search will return images that are similar to the target image. Now, I will use Yandex search engine to perform a reverse image search. I have an image containing the names of some cloud services offered by AWS. We will identify all the web pages indexed by Yandex that contain this image. Click on the square next to the search button to open up the visual search dialog box. Here you can either upload an image or paste the URL to an image. I will upload the image from my computer. We can see the list of words and phrases identified from the image. Here are the list of web pages containing this image. On the right pane, you can find images similar to this one. You can also crop the uploaded image to perform a reverse image search only on a specific portion by clicking on the Select Crop Area button. Now you can adjust this box and click Done to perform the search. You can view the search results. Now I will perform a reverse image search using Google search engine. This is the target image. Click on the search by image option in the right side of the search bar. You can upload an image or paste the URL to the target image. Here is the list of other web pages containing the same or similar image. One result is using a flipped version of the target image. Google also allows you to crop a specific portion of the image and perform a search. This image contains some text in a foreign language. Let's select the region containing the text and click on Translate. Google displays the text in your default language. You can also utilize Bing search engine for reverse image searches. Yandex and Bing also allow you to crop images before performing a reverse image search. You can also translate text found in an image into different languages. Try it out. TinI is a search engine specially designed to perform reverse image searches. It also accepts images or the URL to an image. Now I will perform a search for this image. Once the results are displayed to you, you can sort them based on the various criteria listed here. You can also filter to view only the results from a specific website. For each result, you can view the date when it was first found on a web page. When you click on the icon here, you will be shown a window. You can click on the compare button to compare the target image and the image found on the web page. During an OSINT investigation, if you are dealing with sensitive images, it is not advisable to perform reverse image searches on them. Because, when you upload an image to a search engine, a copy of the image enters the internet. TinEye does not save a copy of the image you perform a reverse image search for. However, I encourage you to decide on the best course of action to take, depending on the nature of the investigation you are working on. Pinterest has a built-in image search tool. In the right bottom corner of a pin, you can find a magnifying glass symbol. 
By clicking here, we can search for other pins with similar images. I hope you have a good idea now about how reverse image searching can be performed and the different tools that you can use to perform it. I encourage you to practice using different tools to perform the same task. One search engine may return results different from another that would benefit your investigation. If you liked this video, please hit like and share this video on social media. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to receive more videos like this one. Join our online community of students learning useful cybersecurity skills if you haven't already. To register for a free account right away, go to our website. Happy learning and see you soon!